A splash screen is often added to an application as a way to present to the user a company logo or perhaps some additional information that the app designer would like to show the user before they actually get into the nuts and bolts of the application. Uh, adding a splash screen using Bus Touch is very easy and it's actually part of your global themes. So in order to do um, the adding of a splash screen to your application, the first thing you need to do is go to your Screens and Actions section of your control panel. And I'm going to put this in grid, uh, list view. Hit Add New because you're going to want to add a new screen. In this case, it's going to be a splash screen. So give it a name. We'll call it Splash Screen. And then from the Choose of Plugin Types, pick uh, Splash Screens and hit Add. And it's going ahead and working and doing all that stuff. You can hide this message. Go to your list of screens and actions. You'll see a splash screen screen has been created. If you want, you can go ahead and click on that and uh, go ahead and configure some of the additional settings for it, like uh, animation settings. You can begin a transition uh, after it taps and, and the duration and what's going to happen with that transition. You can add a screen background color. Uh, it can be whatever you want or a screen background image. Um, and if you're going to be developing for both a handset and a tablet, you're going to want to probably do a small device and a large device image. So those are all the configurable options for a splash screen. Now to add the splash screen to your app, you want to click on the Themes link, and this will bring you to the theme for your application. And a theme is essentially a set of global settings that will apply to all screens in the app unless they are overridden on an individual screen basis. And by default, you get a default theme. If you click on that link, uh, you get theme nickname, splash screen, navigation bar status, screen background color, and screen background image. You want to click on splash screen. Uh, it's asking for the splash screen nickname. Uh, if you don't remember, you can hit select. It will give you a list of the screens that you have currently configured for your application. Um, from the splash category in this case, hit splash screen hit save and you now have a splash screen associated with your application uh, make sure you do go back into the screens uh, section if you haven't already click on your splash screen and make sure you adjust the advanced settings the way that you want them and uh, that's all there is to adding a splash screen to your application